Welcome to Hot Chew. I'm Hillal. Andrew. This is what everyone's been waiting for, at least the people I know. Uh, we are doing the Swedish Fish Oreo taste test. But before we get to this guy, we have to do a little bit of teasing. Yeah. So we're going to do the Red Velvet Oreo first. Yes, I just... This is kind of our apology. We are supposed to do this video a day earlier but we're doing it now. Uh, so, the rules. Sorry. We're I'm, gonna, that's all right. I'm just responding to my fiance's text. We're having two of each cookie. One we're gonna have dry, one we're gonna have with milk. Because Oreo, according to them, this is milk's favorite cookie. So we're gonna see if that holds up with a jelly <laughs> and a red velvet cake flavor. So I'm gonna call, I, I don't, if there are children here, I'm gonna call bullshit. So we're gonna go ahead and open up the red velvet cake one. All right. I I just I, I wait. But it, 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 it. You go ahead while I figure this out. So wow. Um. So who all surprised this on me? Anybody that follows us on Facebook or anything anything knows that I'm about as excited as a cancer patient. Oh jeez. <laughs> okay. So we've got our red velvet oh, Oreos. Wow. They smell like red velvet, so... It smells like a whopping okay. amount of cream cheese between an Oreo. So, oh yeah, so these red velvet have it, the special cream cheese filling. So, so here it is. I, I'm going to be very forward, much like my... They are red. They're dark red. Yeah. They look like red velvet. I mean, they they smell like cream cheese. Yeah, it smells um, like a heaping of... So it's cream cheese frosting. It's not cream cheese. That would let's, be let's disgusting. Make that, let's make that distinction Unless here. they come out with bagel flavor. So I don't like red velvet and red velvet by the way is a form of chocolate i know not everybody knows that mm. it's a form of chocolate um i, I don't love no red velvet i'm not particularly fond of it it seemed I, the most disgusting I, other I, than the and, oreo and by the way fish. i don't like oreos that much no, no. Uh, i've never enjoyed them because they leave that chalky ass film in your mouth um <laughs> so here we go this is red velvet to your health our first one dry yeah Mm. No. Um. No. Um. I ate half. Oh, all right. Hold on. No. Mm. Okay, it's not horrible. It's got a bad aftertaste to it. Be right with you. <laughs> One cookie, really. It fills um, your entire mouth. Yeah. Mm. Oh, hold on. We're almost there. Going down's a little hard. Mm hmm. <laughs> As anyone will attest. Um, okay. It wasn't an unpleasant experience as I was chewing it, but now, as I'm kind of breathing into my mouth, it kind of tastes like a dirty ass. I want quoting on that. <laughs> um, you know, I'm going to shock everybody. I kind of liked it. Mm. I mean, I, I, I'm i not going to sit here and eat the package, but it no, wasn't. No, no. There's a footnote. No. I kind of liked it. <laughs> but? I liked one. You liked one. Um, and I desperately want water. Yes, I'm very thirsty Like, now. like okay. I am thirsty. I was getting very thirsty while eating it. Let's not do a whole one with milk. Half. I'm only going to bite yeah. half. Yeah. Uh, they're good, but they really fill your mouth. I mean, that, yeah. that's a lot of cookie. Well, it looks... You're, you're fingering my cookie. I <laughs> pick your own. <laughs> uh, well, it seems a little bit more stuffed with the filling than a normal Oreo because it's already kind of these busting are very at the thick. side. And, at the and actually, you know, I remember regular Oreos, you'd really have to like twist. twist. This one just kind of falls just, apart. Yeah, it's, just, it's like, hi. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to dunk. This oh, is, yeah. This is my Han Solo cup. I, I get the Han Darth Vader Jr. <laughs> Solo. So I'm dunking. We are submerged. Okay, we got bubbles, so now I'm going to pull out. <laughs> and I'm only going to eat half this thing. Cause... Uh, me too. All right, All just right. Here we go. I think milk makes it worse. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. <laughs> it gives a... Man, you can really just taste the cream cheese. Yeah. That is not... It's like dairy on dairy crime. The only way you should eat those with milk is... Get it out of your mouth. <laughs> what an odd... So it wasn't bad dry. 
<laughs> with milk, it was unedible. Um, I wouldn't eat, I, you know, like, these are one of those things I would buy after a novelty. I'd eat one, maybe two, and go, I'm, I'm good. A, it's Never like, have to have that to again. To me, it's almost as filling as eating a slice of... Cream cheese? No, of eating a slice of red velvet cake. Um, I, I don't want more. No. But, but I endorse some more than Pop-Tarts. <laughs> Here's what everyone's been waiting for. Okay, the main event. Uh, where is the opening? I mean, it's a bag, Hilal. You just open it. Yeah, but usually they have this neat lift tab. This Let's one. be honest, like, nobody's revisiting these. <laughs> well, look, it's, it's, it's kind of like Nabisco doesn't want you no. to seal it for freshness. I believe it's all or nothing here. <laughs> <laughs> you're either going to eat the whole bag or promise Or you're going to give them to people you don't like at a house. Andrew, since you're opening it, you take the first whiff. Can't. Oh, these just look radioactive. They smell like Swedish fish. I mean, they really smell like... I love Swedish fish. Okay. I mean, they smell like Swedish fish. It's like a, it's like a gummy. Like, it's no joke. I mean, that's Swedish fish. <laughs> that is really creepy. Hold on. I want to... How easily does it bust open? Really oh. easily. Not as easily as the red velvet. It, you can see it's a little gummy. It, you know what it looks like? Oh, my God. I, I can't appreciate this. This is Play-Doh. I swear to God. <laughs> it looks like Play-Doh. Yeah, it's no, no, here. here. Mine's yeah. sectional. Yeah. It, it's Play-Doh. It smells really good. It's it smells like a Swedish Play-Doh. Yeah. This is a Swedish fish. Wow. Okay. I'm, I'm pretty sure it won't translate to I'm this. I'm going to put the whole thing in my mouth and eat half with the milk. So, you do what you like. I'm just putting it in. I mean, we're, we're going in. To your health. Oh. <laughs> this is so bad. This is terrible. <laughs> Be right with you. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. No, no. It's kind of like eating a stale circus peanut. No, it's not. That's the flavor I'm getting. Oh. <laughs> okay. So. I've had a lot of interesting things in my mouth. That yeah. was definitely number one. It, it, it was it was like eating a Jackson Pollock painting. <laughs> it's up to interpretation. Um, <laughs> that so, was odd. Uh, get get render your. Yeah. Um. Okay. It smelled like a Swedish fish. It. it, it I. You can't that's appreciate where, it. Yeah. These smell really good, but it does not. I mean, and I would imagine if I were to just eat the frosting, it would taste like a Swedish fish. But the Ooh. the gummy flavor with uh, the chocolate of an Oreo, it was it was a very weird flavor. Um, it, uh, it's not a pleasing flavor. Um, well, okay, so uh, Swedish fish are actually one of my favorite candies. I love gummy bears, Sour Patch Kids. No, but Swedish fish tastes like Swedish fish. Yeah. Um, they sm again. I mean. I, I could do that. Yeah. Um, if this was just a box of the Swedish Fish cream. Ew. Um, but look, so, it, it looks radioactive, first of all. So I'm going to I'm gonna render my, how I feel about eating these in one sentence. Okay. I'd rather eat an a Root Beer Pop-Tart. <laughs> um, uh, it was very weird. It's, like, it's, it's kind of, so first of all, you have this chocolate, and then you have this weird cherry... <laughs> At first, you get the overwhelming chocolate because that's the first thing you bite into, and then this cherry flavor, which kind of tastes like a dirty Slurpee. It, does, it thank you. It <laughs> tastes like a Slurpee, but not a good Slurpee. Like one that's been. <laughs> it tastes like a, a homeless person Slurpee. <laughs> <laughs> like a homeless. And person. I don't mean literally a brand of flavor that caters to homeless people. No, like or, a homeless person. I mean literally they had it into... and then they put it on the counter and you mistakenly drank it. So it was it was very odd. Uh, it's not a good taste. No, it the... is a it is a bizarre. It's funny because when you put it in your mouth and you taste the Swedish fish you're expecting the softness of a gummy but then you're met with this hard cookie chocolate thing and it's every thing you love about swedish fish is completely obliterated by the cookie it's what 
Uh, you know, uh, you know. I think I said it's just a really confusing. Yeah. Uh, it, what if you just ate the cream? No, then you. I just as soon as just eat a Swedish fish, <laughs> and it not be creamy. I will test you on that after we do the milk one. I uh, will. I, I will even go that route. Okay. So we're gonna do milk right now I because mean, milk is the thing with Oreos. We've eaten now three Oreos. They are. Uh, we've eaten. Excuse me. One, two and a half Oreos. Very. I'm like. I'm getting full. Yeah. <laughs> This, uh, is, this is a lot. My family around. likes the uh, traditional Oreo. Oh, your family likes Oreos. Yeah. Get the F out of here. Yeah. My stepdaughter <laughs> loves Oreos. Uh, oh, I thought you were talking about your biological family. No, no, my stepdaughter, my wife. They like the traditional oh, I, I, Oreo. I, I'm sorry, I could just that, imagine your family eating well, Oreos. They do. That being <laughs> said, they're not eating a stack of Oreos. They're eating an Oreo. So, well, but, I mean, but yeah. an Oreo is its own flavor. I mean, this is... A really weird blend of flavors. I and now we're going to add one. And now we're going to add milk to this uh, concoction. Oh, <laughs> Dear help. This, uh, this is, there we go. Hold it's on, in. hold on, hold on. I, I want to make sure this... Th they are extremely hard to chew. I am fully all submerged. Right, I'm right. getting this cookie soft. You're doing the... <laughs> oh, my, my man down. <laughs> it went a man on me. All right, here we go. Right. I'm only eating half. Yeah, me too. Boom. Wow. Actually, um, I can taste more of the Swedish fish. Yeah. And not the butt flavored chocolate. <laughs> okay, the milk helped. The milk helped. I still wouldn't eat these. No, uh, it definitely helped. Uh, it kind of softened up the chocolate, made it a little, made the texture a little bit more palatable. Yeah, I mean, the milk, the milk helped. And these, these weren't as much of a bear to eat as the red velvet ones. Like, no. It, like, the red velvet ones, you have to chew. I well, mean, it, well, the red velvet, it was like eating a cake. Yeah. But like, I think it's because there's cream cheese mixed so, into the So my, my argument is the same one I made for the, the soda flavor pop tarts. Um, why do these exist? I don't know. I, I, you know what it is? I, I would just as soon eat Oreos, although I hate Oreos, but I would eat an Oreo. Or I'd eat... Swedish fish. We're running low on battery, so we're gonna go ahead and try the filling real quick. <laughs> I'm just gonna scrape it. Yeah. Oh. Oh. No. 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 That's the worst tasting thing I've oh. ever had. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> wow, that is. That is like every chemical mixed into one beaker and spread upon a cookie. Okay. Now I'm beginning to think it's not Oreo's fault. It's <laughs> whoever can what a weird thing wow um <laughs> it tasted like oreo cream that was but it was but weird. with only a weird hint of swedish fish it was like castor oil in it or something like like it started separating what an incredibly unpleasant experience it was like having water and oil in my mouth uh, uh um, so i'm gonna render my opinion i think both of these are horrible <laughs> you know what but the swedish fish like red velvet these are cookies you mm -hmm. could eat these. I don't like them, but people would like them. Yeah. <laughs> Who likes this? I don't get it. <laughs> like, I genuinely don't get I it. I think the novelty is that it's Swedish fish, but I don't see anyone clamoring for you more know, of these. You know what they should have done? I mean, it was a Swedish fish with flavored cream. You know what they should have done? Just jam the a, a Swedish, fish. Swedish <laughs> fish in there, and these would be epic. <laughs> As of now, they're weird. Like, they're... I mean, like... <laughs> they were bad. I, I mean... mean they smell like Swedish fish, like no joke. If you were to hold this under me, I'd say, oh, that's a bag of Swedish fish. Yeah. But when you, the cream by itself is unedible. Like, the, the there are things you should like because they are what they are. Yeah. I don't know what these are pretending to be. They're certainly not pretending to be Oreos <laughs> or Swedish fish. <laughs> so that's our Swedish fish Oreo taste test. I'm Hillal. No, down. Oh. <laughs> I'm Hillal. Andrew. This is Hachu. Thanks for watching. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll talk to you later.